And something new for the science books, a species nobody knew about until now. This is ABC 7 News at 6. Well, coming up next, the taming of the shrew. A little critter that we share the planet with, but you know what? No one knew about it until now. In San Francisco today, the debut of a new species. The California Academy of Sciences proudly displayed a small critter discovered in Africa. As ABC 7's Wayne Friedman reports, this is most unusual because it's a mammal. And by now, we thought we had seen them all. Bigfoot it isn't, but as biological surprises go, it looms large. What you see on the video is, is actually pretty incredible. According to Dr. Galen Rathbun of the California Academy of Sciences, it's a one in a million shot of a new elephant shrew photographed by happenstance last year in Africa, Tanzania, the Uzungwa Mountains. They captured the first of these creatures in 2006, but here it is in action foraging for insects to have the rarest of all elephant shrews stop in front of a camera and practically pose is providence. You do not get free-ranging videos of elephant shrews. It doesn't happen. Until now, there were only 15 known species of elephant shrew. This is number 16. It's different because it has a gray face, it has a black rump, and it weighs more, about a pound and a half. How difficult is it to discover a new mammal? Uh, very difficult. Dr. Jack Dumbacher, curator of more than 30,000 specimens at the Academy of Sciences. He says that by now we thought we knew every mammal. To find a new one, like getting a new piece in an old puzzle and then trying to fit it in. The key word is evolution, and it is happening. Even now? Even now, absolutely. So we might look deeper than the fact that this creature lives in a small 150 square mile area on the other side of the world, or that it eats mostly ants. The surprise, that at a time when climate change is forcing the extinction of many, many species, we found a new one. At the California Academy of Sciences in San Francisco, Wayne Friedman, ABC7 News. Isn't that wild?